So you probably searched for this video or you got recommended trying to find alternatives for Google Play Store on your Huawei devices. So if you guys did know, Google Play services suspended their services and applications on the Huawei devices and in turn of that Huawei decided to make a alternative for your favorite apps. So if you wanted to get your Google Maps, Google Drive, Google Photos, any Google Play services or basically any app that you love, your top favorite apps like Instagram, Facebook, Messenger, there are three ways you could go about installing that onto your device without having to be using a PC cables it's all hands-free so though any further ado let's jump into that so there's three ways you could go about getting these applications running on your device now as you can see right here i have tons of apps like spotify youtube studio instagram twitter reddit all of those are from these three applications that i'm going to tell you about now the first one is the primary application for apps on the huawei device and it's called the huawei app gallery now huawei's app gallery is what they're pushing and it's their main application store where you could go in search for your favorite apps and it's also the third largest application marketplace in the world with over 420 million users but the thing about it is that it doesn't have all of the top apps that you'd like all of the apps that are probably created in the u.s because of the terms and services with the u.s government and the chinese government but we won't get into that but just know that you could get most apps from app gallery now apps that you could get from app gallery is like TikTok, snapchat facebook and i think that was like all the main applications that i really like you can also get like the epic games application from here it has the app manager your top apps category just like any app store but as i said before it's brand new so huawei is working with developers to get some of your favorite apps on here but in the meantime you could use two other methods to get some of the top favorite apps that you're probably watching this video for so the second way to get your applications onto your brand new huawei device is using phone clone now phone clone is an application that you could find both on iOS and also the Google Play Store so you install it onto your older device and it comes pre-installed onto the Huawei device so you don't have to worry about that and then you literally just scan a barcode and it will transfer all your images, your photos and your favorite applications from your older device over onto the Huawei P40. The third and final way you could get your favorite apps onto your P40 is by using an application called Pedal Search. Now you could find Pedal Search by going into the Huawei app gallery application and search for it. And this is my favorite way of getting apps like Instagram, Reddit, so much Google Play services, Google Chrome, Photos, Maps, Gboard, Drive, NordPass, all of that stuff, Google Duo, straight from the pedal search application basically what pedal search does is search for apk applications for you so it's trusted tested nothing to worry about here and just to show you guys what it looks like let's jump on to a detailed tutorial so if you guys know anything about huawei and the google play store stuff like that you know that these apps right here you're probably wondering how did you get them on your device no you don't need a pc or a computer laptop cables none of that you literally just do it from this app called pedal search and the funny thing is you could find this app inside the app gallery so if you come into the app gallery right here just type in pedal search just like so this is the app that I downloaded straight from the app gallery so if you're always wondering should you buy a Huawei P40 because this phone is actually really good the camera quality is nice I also did a full review not really a review but an unboxing and impressions so if you want to see that I'll leave it down below in the description but this video is also linked from that video focusing on how you could get Google Play services or Google Play applications onto your device so as you can see I have Instagram Twitter Netflix TikTok whatsapp reddit they all work as intended it's straight from an apk website so that's what pedal search does it finds applications from apk websites and installs them straight onto your device now some applications only works as like a browser for example gmail if we go to the gmail app right here any app that you see with this little circular icon on it right here let me try to turn down the brightness you might get some little bending or lines running through the phone but that's because of the brightness and the refresh rate and all that but anyways if you see this little circular icon that means it's like a website app so if i open it it would look something like this and that's the whole experience but most applications don't give you that circle for example let's type in google and we'll see all the google apps that we could get from pedal search 
for example my main concern was Google Maps because I needed Google Maps so I have Google Chrome we could go ahead and install Google Chrome hit download now it's added to our downloads folder let's turn this up a little bit to get rid of all those lines install And we should be good to go installation successful nice next up google maps go ahead and install that from the apk website again add it to downloads install those are like my two main apps and also google photos as well so let's see if we have options for google photos down here yes we do but it it's a browser but let's still try it to show you guys what it looks like okay google photos at the home stream done okay so I'll Google photos up here let's try that let's test that out let's use this always nice so we have Google Chrome here I'm not sure how Google photos will work as a web-based application I don't think that would work on our mobile devices so I think that's a gimmick but the other apps that we installed like Google Chrome definitely will work so let's search for p40 as you can see it's a regular google chrome you could go ahead and sign in with your google account if you want to what other app did i install maps this might show my location so let me just hurry up and spread this out somewhere else so as you can see we could search for um, say jamaica just to show you guys and if we hit directions obviously you know what will happen i don't want to do that because then it will pop up from my home to, to jamaica so yeah you get the idea google chrome works google maps work all of these google play services that i just installed will work with the pedal search application and that's probably the best way you could go ahead and install google play services onto here as you can see i also used it to get instagram you could post you could post your store on your story all of that stuff twitter works well if you want dark mode you could get dark mode as well all of that stuff we have netflix super surprised netflix work but that work TikTok. you could get this from the huawei app gallery itself we have whatsapp here snapchat reddit literally everything and as I said before, most of those apps you cannot find in the Huawei App Store because of whole United Government and stuff like that. But yeah, pedal search is your best bet and your best way to go if you're thinking about installing Google Play services on your new Huawei device. Also, before you guys go, I want to stop and give a huge shout out to my friend Colin. He has 6.57k subs. Go ahead and run up the subs on his channel because without him, this video wouldn't be possible. He posts tech content just like this here on his channel. So the links for him will also be down below in the description. All right, so thank you for watching today's video. Hopefully you could get all your favorite apps on your Huawei P40 series. If you're worried about that, that was the main issue why you were holding off on to buying this phone. Well, worry no more. You could get your favorite apps running on here like Spotify, for example. Super excited that I got Spotify to work on here because this was one thing I was like, oh man, I can't have Spotify. But now with pedal search, I have it here. You don't need any PC, any cables or anything like that. And the thing is, it's a growing application. Like Huawei App Gallery is growing, pedal search is growing. So yeah, it looks good from now. Hopefully Huawei keeps it up. And if you have any questions, please comment down below so I could answer them. And as always guys, love, peace and tweaks. Happy searching for your apps. <laughs> Signing out.